Hola, ¿cómo están? Les habla Jorge Manuel. Today I have what is probably one of my favorite Air Max One drops of the year and it is the Air Max One Live Together, Play Together. So stand by for more details on that. Before we get started y'all, do me a favor and like the video and if you're not subscribed yet, think about subscribing. Again, I got over 200 subscribers now, I'm getting closer to that, to that 250 and as y'all know, as some of y'all know, there is a giveaway at 250 for a Jordan 1 high so stick around, hit that subscription and let's keep it moving. Alright, so I have the Air Max 1 live together, play together and this was also known as I believe the Urban Jungle Gym. Um, I don't know why they changed the name. Uh, maybe it's sort of because that whole urban term has gotten a negative connotation uh, as of late. Um, Y'all know how, how we are socially nowadays. Um, you gotta be so specific, so careful about what words you use to describe certain things. So uh, maybe that's why they changed it. Or maybe that name was just what people thought it was gonna be called. I don't know for sure, but this does come in a collection. <clears throat> I believe it's three other silhouettes that come in the live together, play together colorway. So it is, I believe the Air Raid. It is in Air Force One. And I'm not sure which one the other one is. Uh, it might be just those three. I, I don't know for sure. But these did come out last week in foot action and they will drop again on thursday on sneakers so um from what i saw on foot action it looks like the more popular silhouette in this uh collection is the air raids it looked like those sold out fairly quickly and these uh and these sat for a bit um they're not there anymore but they definitely did sit for a while, which was okay with me because, again, this is one of my favorite Air Maxes of the year. Um, I just hope that the quality is there, but in terms of the colorway, it's definitely dope. So let's go ahead and open this up and take a look. Now, uh, again, this drops Thursday on sneakers, so don't sleep for those of y'all that are Air Max 1 fans like me. Um, I might go ahead and double up on this. Depends on how they look in hand and on foot, but it looks like I'm definitely going to keep these for the personal. There's, there's almost no doubt in my mind. But let's go ahead and unbox. Foot action did take a minute to go ahead and send these to me, but uh, they're finally here. And what I really love about these is the details. The details always do it for me with certain sneakers. Um, sometimes they can go a little overboard with the details, but these, they got certain little additions to the silhouette that I really like that I'll show you once I unbox. But it's always the little details that do it for me for with my favorite silhouettes. And Air Max 1 is definitely one of the top silhouettes for me. So let's go ahead and open this up real quick.
classic Nike box. Shoe tag right there. And let's go ahead and open this up. Now, again, I'm really, really excited about this one. I Air Maxes. Um, I really do. I really do love my Air Maxes, and the Air Max One is the top for me, the OG. So let's go ahead and take a look. And these do somewhat give me that um, Obsidian Air Max One vibe, uh, with a couple of differences here and there. But let's go ahead and see if that's actually the case. All right, y'all. Here they are. The Air Max One live together, play together. So right away, y'all see um, that that inner lining uh, material, which is pretty cool. What does strike me as a little bit different from the pictures of the shoe and having it in hand is actually the color of the mud guard. So you can tell right there, it's black. And from the pictures, it gave me sort of this obsidian uh, look, but in hand, it's 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 black. And then finally, the last detail on this that is that is different from the rest is that uh, symbol right there in the back with the peace sign and the different colors there. I think that's pretty dope. But as y'all know, I don't like going into too much detail. So let's go ahead and lace these up, uh, throw them on feet, see how they look. And then maybe then I'll make my decision as to whether I want to double up on Thursday or not. First impression, these are dope. I really like them. And let me see if there's any differences with the left uh, and the right shoe. Hmm. No, there aren't really any differences. They look pretty much the same. Uh, yeah, let's go ahead and lace them up and throw them on feet.
all right there you have it y'all i really really like these sneakers um again air max one is one of my favorite silhouettes and um there's not very many things you can do to get this sneaker wrong and in this case it's just dope overall i really really like it one other detail that i didn't really notice when i was unboxing these is the stitching on the tongue um, i did show y'all that on the close-up so there's just a lot of little fun details on this sneaker that i really enjoy and again this one that's this is one that's going to stay with the collection i probably will double up come thursday there's almost no doubt in my mind but hope y'all liked the video like and subscribe if you're not subscribed yet we are getting very close to that next giveaway so don't miss out and hit that bell uh, just one time that way you get notified when I do drop the next video who knows maybe the next one I will give further details on that giveaway so we'll see so go ahead like subscribe and I'll see y'all on the next one